A man escaped his burning home in Whitehall. Flames and smoke were coming from the house on Child Drive. Rachel Monjovi was there when crews were battling the fire. She joins us now with how that homeowner is doing tonight. Rachel. The 93-year-old homeowner of this Whitehall house says he watched as smoke billowed from his home of more than 60 years. He was able to safely escape with his dog, but he says it could have ended much worse. I wondered down through what happened to anybody. I didn't think that it was going to happen to me, though. Elmer Maddow is counting his blessings tonight. He's lived at this home on Child Drive since 1961. He says Monday night he returned home from a long drive, parked his car in the garage, and noticed something was wrong with his engine. I got out of the automobile and walked around the front of the uh, car. And I, I didn't have any lights on in there, I mean, but anyway, I, I, I saw the, the smoke and then I, I saw the flame through the cracks. Maddo says flames were coming out of the engine of his 1991 Pontiac, eventually spreading to the house. By the time the fire department got here, it was it developed pretty, pretty good. Pretty good. Maddo was able to escape his home safely with his dog Shelby. Whitehall Fire Chief Eric Harris says the fire started in the garage, spread to the first floor of the home, extended to the attic and onto the roof. Smoke clouds could be seen from above. Harris is crediting Maddo for his quick thinking. Oh yes, it always could be worse. Lucky he, he thought something was wrong and he exited the home. Fire crews tell us the cause of the fire is still under investigation. They tell us the home is badly damaged. Reporting in Whitehall, Rachel Monjovi, KDK News on Pittsburgh CW.